What's up? What's going on, guys? Captain Monk here again with another gameplay commentary. If you guys haven't already noticed, I hopped on a little bit of Modern Warfare 2. Now, not in any way does this mean I like this game, and not in any way does this change that I hate this game. But I'm going to point out that yes, I delete the map packs for this game as well, and holy crap! I mean, in Black Ops, the douchebags are all the ghosts and second chancers. Agreed. I think we've all decided that. In Modern Warfare 2, what are the douchebags? The commando faggots, the one in the attack nightfall game. The faggots want a noob to with one man army. Guess what? All the faggots are gone when you don't have the map packs. I'm not even kidding you. I mean, all these kids want to do is noob tube and crap on the map packs. They're too lazy to get rid of them. And all these kids that have map packs are all tryhards. That's why I'm using all the cheap crap. So if you guys get rid of the map packs, you can actually enjoy this game. No, it doesn't change the fact that I don't like this game. Now, for all those who do not know, the reason I do not like this game is because it's quite skillless, to be honest. I mean, yes, right now, my gun I'm using right now it does have a bit of recoil, but it's got hardly any. ACR has no recoil, Scar H has no recoil, FAMAS has no recoil. I mean, at least in Black Ops, FAMAS has got some recoil, but I mean, in the M16 as well. I mean, the M and don't tell me, oh, the M16 has not have recoil in, our, in um, Black Ops either. I know that, but at least the M16 can't one burst across the map, which is balanced. So, that's why I don't really like Modern Warfare 2. I think it's a quite a skill equalizer game where it doesn't matter how good you are, you're still going to do just as well as everyone else because you're, you've got, like, the best guns in any war I've ever seen. <laughs> like, seriously, I don't, I've don't. i never heard of a gun that has no recoil like the ACR or the Moth. Like, it doesn't happen. So that's why I really like this game. I also think the explosive spam is retarded. Um, I mean, at least in World of War, you could use like bomb squad and flak jacket and stuff like that to be protected from, the, from um, explosives. It's the same thing with Black Ops. You have hacker and um, flak jacket. But Monster 2, there is no counter to that. And don't tell me blast shield because guess what? Blast shield, basically, it's blast shield is like the juggernaut stop power. If that makes sense for explosives. If I'm using a noob tube and I've got danger close, and I hit this guy, he's got um, blast shield on. They basically cancel each other out and make the noob tube a regular noob tube. Kind of like how Juggernaut and Stun Power and Call of Duty World at War. If I were to shoot a bullet at a guy with Stun Power, but he had Juggernaut on it, it would cancel out and become a regular, regular bullet. That's basically how it works. So, blast shield is basically doesn't do crap. In other words, so that's why I don't use that. Anyways, this is a pretty fun game, guys, when people aren't being douchebags. It probably is one of the more fun calls when people aren't being douchebags, but finding douchebag-free lobbies is basically impossible nowadays. I mean, this may sound kind of like a douchebag sort of thing to say, but I honestly find the only way to have fun with Call of Duty nowadays is to play against bad players, because when you play against good and or dicks players, dick, that doesn't make sense, because of the idea... I don't find it fun because good players just will stomp my teammates and guess what? They'll get kill streaks and I'll have to deal with it and it's not fair. I don't enjoy it at all. And I don't like playing against dicks because they're dicks. There's no one wants to play against them. They ruin the game for everyone. So this way with all the map packs, I don't have to deal with that crap anymore and I actually can have fun playing this game. I mean the reason I didn't like Mark 2 probably for the longest time and I still don't, but I mean at least I don't hate it anymore. I just dislike it. Is because I had the map packs for the longest time, but now that I've gotten rid of them, this, I may actually be able to enjoy this game a bit more than I used to. So yeah, I may decide to bring out some more gameplays for you guys, and I'm trying to decide whether I should get rid of the World of War maps or not, because... I mean, if I could play against non-tryhards that aren't using the MP40 in the World of War, it'd be a lot easier to get gameplays, because as it stands right now, I've been playing a lot of World of War as well as Monster 2, and holy crap, man. I've gone against Tempest Siege teams of MP40, and that's all I get put against. It's not even, it's not fun at all. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the gameplay, give it a like, like it a lot, give it a favorite. If you guys enjoy the videos and bring hunts to my channel, it'd be awesome. Thanks, guys, for watching. Hope you enjoyed it again. Good night.